Hello everybody and welcome to a new episode of Coding with Alex. So today we are gonna talk about a list in uh, Swift UI. In the good old days with the UI kit, it was pretty straightforward to scroll the, the list to a uh, specified index path. With the list in uh, Swift UI uh, on the first edition, Swift UI 1.0, it wasn't so easy. Uh, things changed with the Swift UI 2.0, and I'm going to show you how to do this thing. So first thing first, let's build a list. Okay, let's build a list from scratch. So simple list with a for each, for each zero to 100. Okay, let's give it an ID dot self okay and now index in text row number row number uh, index okay let's add a bit of padding to make it nicer okay so it works very nice. Now, want, what I want to do, uh, I'd like to add a row picker here at the bottom of the list where you can select the index. So let's add our list inside uh, this deck because we'll add more than one view. Okay, let's add a spacer, divider, sorry, better to add a divider. And now, Okay, now here we'll insert, we'll insert our picker. So, picker. Okay, no title. Okay, first things first, we need a binding variable. So let's create one at state. Try more selected index. That will be type int and the value, starting value zero. Sorry. Okay, so let's bind it. Okay, our content will be pretty similar to our list. So a simple for each with row number, but our text will be scroll to index and our picker will be of type will. Picker style dot will. Okay, here it is. As you can see, nothing is happening right now. So, what do we need? Okay, we need to use uh, the scroll view reader. Scroll view reader was introduced by Apple on with uh, Swift UI 2.0. So let's wrap everything that we have here inside inside the scroll view reader. So, scroll view reader. Where? you in okay copy and paste okay here we are so the first thing we have to do it will be to give uh, an ID to our row we can use the index itself so every row will have an ID ID 5 6 7 and so on Okay, and the second thing we have to do is to bind the the selection of our uh, scroll our our picker to an action. So to do this, we need uh, a little help. So we need to import import the combine framework. Okay, because here let's add on. Our receive. So our receive takes a publisher. So our publisher will be adjust selected index. Okay. And perform of value in scroll view dot scroll to selected index anchor. Anchor will tell if our selected index will be in the center, 
top or bottom. So let's use standard center. Okay, let's resume and let's run select 16 and you can see 16 is in the middle. Okay, it's nice, but it's not very, very user friendly. So let's add an animation and this action, let's wrap it inside an animation. So simply with animation and our body will be our scroll view, scroll to. So let's start again, scroll to 19, here we are, 40. Let's change it and scroll to 60. That's done. I hope you like it and uh, please subscribe to my channel. See you soon.